Hi there folks, welcome back to my channel and for this video I'm still in the Kingsley Fife I've actually just come along the road a wee bit from St Monans and I am now in the town of Pit and Weem which essentially is between St Monans and Anstruther again it's right on the coast and from the, the photos that I've seen of uh, Pit and Weem so far it looks like a really pretty gorgeous little place and that's just been backed up by the little I've seen uh, driving through in order to try and get a, uh, a space for the car. So I'm going to grab my things in a minute and head down into the town itself, try and get down to the harbour and try and show you what's going on in Pit, Pit and Wheem. And yeah, so hopefully with the weather it is still holding up, it's still proven to be a really nice day, so fingers crossed. And yeah, so again, if you are enjoy my channel if you enjoy my videos if you can click on the subscribe button if you can click on that notification bell leave some likes leave some comments it's always really appreciated and if you'd like to support the channel further i will post a link to the channel's tiktok account and the channel's uh, coffee.com page in the description bar below and in a pinned comment in the comment section so with that out of the road can i grab my things and head on out Let's uh, make it down to the harbour. Here there are we cafes and other places we can get something to eat. And there's this other wee way down to the harbour as well. There's plenty of ways down to the water. You can just see wee cottages like this throughout the town. And I think a lot of the, the paths down to the harbour are fairly steep, so just to give you a heads up. Again, just come with sensible shoes. Take your time, there's no point in rushing. Yeah, this is the other way down. That's next to the parish church. And as you can see, it's stepped. So probably easier than walking down such a steep slope that you get the other one. That's the first or fourth out there. This is pretty. Yeah, this here is actually the cold sort of felon's cave. It's not open just now. I think you've got to go and get a key from the wee chocolate shop up on the high street. And it's at a pounds to get in. Yeah, I don't think I'd probably go in just now because it's really quite dark. I don't have my torch with me. Apparently there's the light switches there. Just my luck, somebody just happened to come down with a key and I've managed to sneak into the cave. Yeah, I have to admit I wasn't expecting to be able to get into St Fillon's cave. And it was just by chance that somebody was coming down with a key anyway because she wanted to have a wee nosy. Uh, because somebody else wanted to come in and they're coming in a wheelchair so she was doing a wee bit of a recce so I managed to like follow in behind her and have a wee nosy round and okay there isn't much in the cave but it's still a really interesting place to go and have a, a wee nosy, a wee view, they look uh, I'm guessing, I don't have, so Fillin isn't a saint that I've heard of before I'm guessing it must be a, a local saint and um, but it's just nice, nice to I was kind of, it's definitely kind of interesting to be able to kind of get, get into a wee shrine like that. Uh, not, not particularly religious myself, but I, I just kind of interested from a, a kind of a historical point of view or an archaeological point of view. 
but it's definitely be an interesting stop on my wee explanation of the town. Let's try and see what else I can find. And as you can see, this is a lot busier hut as a harbour than St. Monan's. Obviously, the bigger ships coming this way. And also, the local art gallery. So, lots of marine themed artwork. So, a memorial to the fisher folk and to those who have lost their lives making a living from the sea. Yeah, uh, we've got a wee book club. This is a wee book club. Right, that's the inscription. Uh, that looks like some weather coming in. And in a distance, you can just make out St. Monan's uh, windmill, St. Monan's Kirk. There's a couple of folk out there with a kayak just now. I found this stood at one of the houses at the harbour. Interesting little story. As far as close as I can get to it. I've managed to get up to the real lighthouse at Piss and Weem. Some very dramatic skies over there. Well, that's me back at the car for my little visit to Piss and Weem. And I think I've just gotten back into the car right at the right time. Because I think that's just the, the rain starting. But again, it's, it's been a good little visit to Pit and Wim. Uh, just nice to be able to go for a wee wander, we explore, get to see the town. And after that, again, this is somewhere else that I hadn't been to before. But it's always, so it was kind of nice to be able just to come along and have a wee visit. And the fact that I was able to get into St. Villain's Cave, which I wasn't expecting to get into sea. Uh, that was just a nice little addition to the wee trip. So hopefully you will all have enjoyed this video. Hopefully you will all have found Pit and Weem intriguing and you'll come along for a visit. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye.